Have you ever wondered why there are routers that cost as much as 30,000 pesos? Pretty good question, right? Sure, you can have a free router from your internet service provider, but the capabilities are very basic. Aside from giving you Wi-Fi signal, investing on a good router can let you do more such as wireless stream videos up to 4K resolution, local network transfers, so you don't have to plug in in and out a USB from different devices, your own personal crowd storage, wireless printer setup, gaming management, multiple wireless SSID networks, better signal management, AI protection for security threats, and the feature most will love, an easy router management using your mobile phone through a dedicated app for a more secure and intuitive setup as compared to the old 192.168.1.1 text user interface method. But with so many routers in the market right now, you're probably overwhelmed of which one you need. Well, the answer will lead you to three factors. Try to answer them as accurate as possible. Number one, what is the speed of your internet connection? Usually speeds of 1 to 3 Mbps is no problem for any router. But when you get to 5 Mbps and above, then that means you can already do more such as high definition video streaming, multiple files downloading, and even intense online gaming. With this, we recommend getting a router with dedicated traffic management software to properly handle your internet requirements. This means that all applications can be handled and will prioritize certain apps if necessary, especially for gaming like this RTAC88U router with its internet game boost features. Not to mention that you might do high definition streaming over your TV, transfer tons of data from PC to PC at faster speeds, and even separate your wireless network among others for additional security. Number 2. Check your gadgets and how many do you have? Are you using one of the latest gadgets today? Perhaps a flagship smartphone which utilizes the latest 802.11 AC signal with a 5GHz band. Aside from your phone, check how many other devices do you have like your laptops, family members gadgets, Apple TV, Chromecast devices, printers, wireless IP cameras, and even take to consideration future-proofing your network as you will eventually have more gadgets in the future. So it means you need a router with an 802.11 AC capability using that 5 GHz band. With this, speed transfer is up to 1.3 gigabits per second with less signal interference from other devices as the 5 GHz band isn't overcrowded. All that while your router handling multiple sessions from all of the devices connected. A modern home today can have up to 30 wireless devices connected easily in their network meaning a basic router can simply do that job. And the last question is, how big is your area? Are you living in a house, two-story perhaps or even more, or even a condominium unit? Just remember that you need to map out where to put your router for a more effective signal distribution. Advanced routers today have the technology called AI Radar, which is able to direct signal to your devices in specific locations. This is more effective than broadcasting signals everywhere and the signal is stronger and more isolated. With everything I said, I'm sure it's still complicated for non-techies to absorb. That's why it's a lifesaver to buy routers that can be easily managed through a smartphone app. No more annoying web addresses and everything is just a tap away. Choosing the right router can overall lead to a better internet or network experience. You'll have a better signal coverage, convenience of streaming, less downtime, and even fit for the proper gaming experience. That's it for now. If you liked the video, please hit the thumbs up and consider subscribing. For any questions, hit us in the comment section below and we'll try to answer them. I'm Ethan of Hungry Geeks. See you next episode.